I saw the uh, coffee table, the like. Uh, Flip, change yeah. camera to you. I saw like the the like over the fuck what's it called over the moon over the, like, the city rainbow? no it's like the city that like it like curves or whatever inception that dude table. yeah i saw that online i just fucking said it no i know i know i saw that online and i was trying to buy it it's like two thousand dollars what is two thousand dollars the car like it was it was the making of that coffee table it was sweet a coffee table in inception no, it was like the thingy. The fucking damn. Can we play it? We start this fucking thing. <laughs> That's how it starts. That's how it, people need to hear that. <laughs> yeah, people need to I hear that. Is he talking about Inception? I don't, I don't know. No, 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 no. I've okay, never so, seen Inception. Well, someone. Uh, so, no, I'm talking about this oh, coffee no. table I saw <laughs> online. <laughs> <laughs> We got Tone Time, Nick Pack, Connor, Jimmy Z, Big Motor, Jay, and Evan. And me. So when you hear you got nothing to lose. If you don't, then you're a sellout, but you're stupid. Round of applause, here come the boys of the pod. Welcome. Fuck yeah! Yes. Mitt, Mitt's here. Mitt, what the fuck are you talking about? I saw a sweet ass coffee table that was uh, resembling the like curved uh, buildings in Inception when the fucking uh, when the buildings start just like going up and shit, and it was really cool. And it was like <laughs> I was about to buy it, and then I saw the price, and it was like two thousand dollars. All right, well, uh, Boston Connors here. Tony's here. <laughs> so dumb. Gumpy's back there. Z. It is a sweet fucking table, though. I found it. Oh, shit, really? Is yeah. it actually? It's yeah. so cool. But. Two grand? To put your fucking water pipe on? That is actually kind of sweet. He did a terrible job That's describing cool. it, but that is cool. That's cool. That, Man, exactly that doesn't look like a fucking doing. coffee table, though, dude. Are we sure it's a coffee table? Yeah, it is. Okay. I, that's just what the description said. Looks, I don't really know what the fuck a coffee table is. It looks massive. Listen, hold on, a hold man on. who has dropped a hefty sum on a coffee table, I can respect it. You okay. don't know what a coffee Fair. table is, Mitt? Uh, what, like, what is a coffee table, technically? It's what do you like think it is? What do you think? Put your dude. bong and weed on, dude. It's a, Centerpiece. It's a coffee table book together. about coffee tables. Yeah, Ooh. it's just like a table. Uh, yeah, correct. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Fucking hot start. All right. All right. Uh, <laughs> Let's get right. into See, now that nobody is listening anymore because they turned this off. I mean, it's hard to come in hot out of the gate with the coffee table talk, but we did it. We managed. We got through it somehow. True. Uh, has anyone watched anything good this weekend? I watched a couple things that I'd like to talk about oh, and get yeah. your guys' opinions. I watched uh, Nobody. Uh, Great movie. That? Really good. Fucking uh, Better Call Saul. Better John Call Saul. Are we out oh, of yeah. Kirk. Was that good? Paul Odenkirk. Uh, it was pretty good. Are we out of the spoiler like realm? or? No, I haven't watched it. No, we're still not out. I mean, I'm, it's not out on VHS yet. I'm probably okay. not going to watch There's it. There's some good kills. Very Great good kills. kills. Very good Russian. Oh. Good Russian. Good Russian. There's always, it's yeah. always sweet to have a good Russian. Good storyline. Not a spoiler, but Doc Brown's in it. Yep. Oh. Not a spoiler. Christopher Lloyd. John, John Wick's dude directed it or whatever, I think. Really? And he loves what? having a John Russian. John dude. He loves having a Russian in it. Really? Well, yeah. yeah I mean, it, there's Russians in all the John Wicks, right? There's I always think a, so. You need a good Russian. Isn't he Russian? You need a good Russian John adversary. Wick is not Russian. Well, dude. the house he goes to. He's about as American as they come from. The, no, the house he goes the to. Bath the bathhouse? No, 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 no. He goes to the place uh, where they fuck. Is this in the last one or the first one? Where oh, the yeah. lady who like owns the theater and makes the ballerinas dance. Oh, uh, number two. Yeah, is that that's the second no, one? No, I forget. No, I forget. No. But either way, isn't that lady Russian? And she brought him into the Russian family? I think the... Pikachu. Well, there's the one guy that walks around in his underwear with all the tattoos. He's definitely Russian. That guy's Dude. definitely Russian. Vigo Mortensen? Maybe John Wick I isn't Russian, Vigo. but I think he represents the Russian uh, house of John Wick's. What nationality is John Wick? I think he was like Polish. I don't know. Wick. What is Wick? What is Wick? Well, it's Wick. probably short for... John Wick. Hauser. John Wick. Sham. Oh, he's, he was born in Belarus. Belarus. Okay, so he Poland? is. Um, he was an orphan taken in Belarusian. by the Russian mafia. There it is. I knew it. Okay. Yes. I mean, you basically were right. Fuck yeah. Good but he's, he's, he's Belarusian. Good yeah. day, though. Mother right? Russia. Russia. Without remorse. The Tom Clancy movie. Did everyone see that? Better That's than got that. some Russians. Better than nobody. 
That one's better than nobody. Okay, really. I think so. Okay, we haven't. Did I you haven't see seen either? That. I didn't see nobody. I saw without remorse. I enjoyed it. It was fun. I thought it was I better than. That. They're two different movies. But if you had to pick one to watch, you'd watch No Remorse. I think so. Is nobody uh, without remorse? I don't want to call it a parody. No. But is it like way over the top? Uh, make fun of John Wick, or is it like this is sweet? This dude wanted to make a John Wick movie. And I think did. it's sweet. Okay, I think it's sweet too. I think that the only uh, thing that they like allude to that is Wick esque, if you will, is the reasoning, like the reasoning for him just going off fucking absolutely slaughtering everybody. Spoiler. Well, he didn't say what the reasoning was. The no, reason he didn't. Was. Okay. No spoiler. No spoiler. But that, I think, is the only tip of the cap. Like, hey, this is just like... What else is out there right now? What about the... Mm. uh, Son of Sam. Sam, Son of Sam was good. Watch that. The the, uh, male guy? No. uh, David Berkowitz. New York in the 70s. Murder. Wasn't there a movie? Spike, did he do a movie on it? Berkowitz wasn't the male guy? Who's the male guy? The male guy? Unabomber. Nah, he wasn't the mail guy. I Ted mean, he, Kaczynski. He sent stuff in the mail, but one of those... Oh, you've got mail with Tom Hanks? Not serial killer. That was a male man. No, no, this is more of a... Uh, this is more of a satanic Ooh. murder. Yeah. The uh, Booker T doc was fucking awesome. Booker it, T on A&E was supposed to be very good. If you haven't watched any of those wrestling docs on A&E, they are all, they've all been great. They've, even if you haven't watched... Yeah, that, that's a, even if you haven't watched wrestling yeah, in like 20 yeah. years, those are still awesome to watch. Isn't... Uh, who's next? Rob Van Dam? Is it really? RVD? I, I think no so. fuck your way. I saw... I bought Either he's next or he's coming up because I did see really? like a minute... Yeah, a minute Losing little... insincerity. Like, fucking montage of it. Maybe RVD's it was just like... No, that was when he just beat John Cena. No, I wish. They didn't have that. They just had him like... Even when... Because they're talking about when he was a kid. That's why I think it's part of the doc. It's like his mom. Like, even when Rob was a kid, he hated... He hated, uh, you know, being told what to do. I don't know if this is a spoiler alert or not, but at one time... Fucking Berkowitz did work for the Postal Service. They always say the Postal Service people, you, you gotta watch it. out for them. I fucking knew it. Yeah, they know your area. Yeah, you did. You knew it was mail. It's, it's like, pretty uh, good. Sinbad from Jingle All the Way. Exactly. It's good. Just watch the last episode, like the second and the last what one. Are you gonna miss details? If you watch the first one and the last one, uh, I don't think you'll miss enough where Spoiler. you're like, what's going on? I don't wanna miss anything. Okay, watch them all. But the third episode will kill you. Spoiler. He doesn't want to close his eyes. Boom. Like, he doesn't want to like fall cats? asleep. Cause Cause he show us the butthole. The show. And I don't, don't want to miss a thing. How about them? Have you guys watched them yet? Nah. No. Possibly, not possibly, definitely the most disturbing television I've watched outside of the Scott Stotts episode of The Office. <laughs> I saw that. That, that says a lot. Finished that series. Uh, it was very uncomfortable to watch, but had you hooked the whole time. Glued. Very interesting. Uh, also watched Heard, Things Heard and Seen on Netflix. Oh, Heard Immunity. A horror thriller with Talk Amanda Seyfried. One of the best movies I've seen in a oh, long time really? for the first like, Seyfried's hour. Seyfried's still around? Oh, hour, she's yeah. great in it. For the first like hour 45, the ending was absolute dog shit. Yeah, so I'm she gone. looks like Golem. I'm not watching it. Have it was Seyfried? like... Uh, it was you know like, who C3D is, dude. No, yeah, no, you know, gross. You know no, about. No. But she said she looks like Gollum. Yeah, that's not true. That's they, yeah. They do that in Ted too. Yeah. Have you ever seen fucking <laughs> Little Red Riding Hood or Hood or Red Riding Hood? Yeah, Hood? I like that movie a lot. Actually, Hood. I mean, she crushes a Mean Girl. Forever will. But what were that's you watching? <laughs> it was like. Uh, it was like if uh, Steven Spielberg put together a movie for the first like hour and 45 minutes and handed the last 10 minutes off to Mitt. Damn. That's what it felt like. I can't do that. When I can't it, do bad endings. I know. And, and I almost, I want to force you to watch it just so you can experience. Just tell us the good ending. What's it called again? It and then we fucking feel it. Things, things heard yeah. Things heard and seen. And it's all on the flicks? It's on the flicks. On flicks. Big flicks. Shout out flicks. It'll suck you in. It's like a, like a dr- little drama horror thriller. Uh, but it doesn't go the way they usually go. Like this couple moves into this old house where a uh, ghastly murder happened. Oh, shit. And so you think, oh, okay, the ghost is going to haunt them, blah, blah, blah. But it doesn't quite go that way. Okay. It's a little bit of a curveball in that aspect. Okay. And then the end comes around and it's like, oh, shit, I really wish they would have just went that way. You were on to something, you had something going, and then you fucked it all up. God damn it. I might just watch the last 10. Then. I know, me too. It might be worth it just to see how big of a train wreck that movie ended up as. All right, I'll Johnny do it. Curveball. I heard. I watch uh, it because I'm interested to see what Seafried looks like these days. Looks good. Yeah, yeah. Be it's also pretty uh, good cast Seafried. too. The uh, Seafried is a there's uh, the the guy from <laughs> Homeland who becomes Damien Lewis. 
not Damian Lewis, not Quinn, not Patinkin, Giamatti, the the guy who <laughs> Patinkin works with, the old guy with the beard, oh, the oh yeah, the bad guy. and the bald head. Yeah, yeah, oh, no, he's not. Bad. He definitely colors his beard. What's that? Oh, I think he dyes his beard. He Was might his beard gate. A lot of people do as they age. I did mine a little bit the other day. Did you? Did you? Mm-hmm. How'd it go? Why don't you just let it salt and pepper? Yeah, did, salt and pepper yeah but you've yeah. seen mine like before. It's it's a, it's a ghastly white. I thought you just <laughs> trimmed your beard. It's just a patch. I wouldn't describe it as ghastly. What did you dye it with? Touch of gray. Thank you. Touch of gray beard tr- beard mm-hmm. stuff. You you use the beard wash. No, no, no. I used to have that, but it turned my fingernails uh, brown. Yeah, it'll do that. <laughs> Fair. I heard uh, Jupiter's ass. Legacy was better than the boys. <gasps> you shut your mouth. <laughs> That's just what I heard on the internet. Listen, <laughs> why, why won't you watch the boys? Dude. It's like a show you would love. <laughs> he why refused to watch it. He still loves watch it. watching it. He refuses to watch it. He sat watched there and you wonder why you think every fucking minute. Jupiter's Moons is better than <laughs> Look, that's just what people were Jupiter's saying. Jupiter's Legacy is a Mickey Mouse version of the boys. I don't know. That's not what I heard. I you heard, heard wrong, better. pal. Z did show me a couple episodes of The Boys, and after one, no, of them, you watch like, one, just... and you want to get up at every minute. Z was like, you, "You want to watch another?" Part. I was like, "Nah." <laughs> Let's what do you mean? I don't know. I just wasn't into it. I'll watch it. It's Rogan. Oh, no, you won't. Dude. It's Seth Rogan. What's it called? I Jupiter's won't. Landing. You're right. You're right. Jupiter's Legacy. Legacy. It's another one on Netflix now, and it's like a superhero family adjusting to the modern times oh, and like the family's high. about to take right. over to the old man. I'm in for that. According to IMDb, it is a Mickey Mouse fucking the boys because the boys has an 8.9 rating. Jupiter's Legacy has 6.9. So yeah, but that's because fucking Rogan It's got Josh, Josh Duhamel, though. Really? It does. Or Duhamel. Duhamel. Well, however you say it. Josh Duhamel. 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 I'm trying to picture who that guy is. Oh, he's at. fucking Trident? He's, uh, he? He what do they like, call him? They call him the, um... He looks like the Emperor of the Undersea. The Utopian is his name. Ooh. The Atlantean. Is this like that one Carter movie? <laughs> Let me see what he looks like. <laughs> I, thought you, one I thought you movie. watched it. No. <laughs> Coach, Coach Carter? Carter dude. Jupiter's no, Legacy. there was like a, uh... Um, it was like Avatar's, Ooh. like, uh... Hell yeah. They were trying to compete with Avatar. I think his weapon's Trident. What's his name? The Carters? No. Jupiter? The Carters. No, no, no. Uh, Poseidon. Thank you. Uh... Same person, different <sighs> Trying religions. to compete with Avatar Lost Airbender. Um, Jupiter and Poseidon. The no. same person. Yeah, I think that's the Roman and Greek iterations of them. You know, uh, Greek I was... <laughs> I was hesitant, but then I saw, like, when you put it on, it has the little ratings in the corner. Yeah. And it dropped, like, a TV MMA, like, uh, sexual nudity, blah, blah, Whoa. blah. And I haven't seen any of in it yet. In landing? I haven't seen any of it yet, but yeah. So there's potential dump outs. It feels like they're saving the dump outs for the season finale, <laughs> as they should. Have you? What's that? Have you um, traveled in a dump out? Have you seen any episodes of this? Of what? Jupiter's Legacy? <laughs> no, I just heard it was better oh, than the boys, dude. dude. You're an idiot, dude. Unbelievable. How dare you, dude. Something to think about. What else? Anything else? Anyone wants to get off their chest? Any other shows, movies? Oh, I met a Satan worshiper. What? Who? <laughs> oh. uh, I recently got a new dog. And the lady who gave us the dog. You got a, a second worshiper. dog? Yeah. You got a Satanist you dog? You adopted a, dog? a Satan worshiper's dog. No, so, she worshiped the What made you get pond. a second dog? Bad news. Uh, I don't know. My lady wanted one. But okay. but we were talking to the lady, and we somehow got in the conversation of, like, the devil. Okay. And she was, <laughs> like, she was like, fuck yeah, I love the devil. No, she was like, what did he do wrong? Her, she's had dad. He just had daddy issues. Whoa! And uh-huh. I was like, it was. We didn't even get to her being a Satan, Satanist. Who's Devil's dad? Did you tell her Tim well, Tebow is playing tight end. Excuse me, what? So God. Oh, that's Tactical. how we got in the conversation because she not like human. He was, a, he was an angel. He was human. Then oh, he died, became an he angel, lost, lost his got, wings. He, he, he about, fell from heaven. Talking about little Nicky. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, very odd. Uh, but hey, good people though. So not you didn't really explain family. anything there. You just talked about. Yeah, literally, that's what happened. I found out, and then I couldn't get out of the conversation because I'm I'm big on going deeper. Yeah. Without knowing I'm going deeper, and yeah, I found out her whole entire life story and how she likes the devil. So you, is a you adopt a Satanist dog, and now well, your no, dog is... Well, no, she was is... just an employee at the shelter. Was your dog oh, dog okay, dog. so it wasn't <laughs> the dog's owner. Yeah, have you woken up and your dog's fucking standing over top of you yet? <laughs> I think we should... Well, you know what? If they're tech, if they're caring for dogs, how big of a Satanist can they really be? Well, yeah. pretty big, because they, they are releasing themselves. some of the devil into all the dogs and spreading it through the community. I hope not. Oh, that's fucked up. We're going to find out well, very soon. Shy has a very good heart. Good luck, see you. Zeet, uh, good you, heart's turn. You yeah, want to tell us? Uh, uh, like you want to tell us about Tractor Zeet and how you ripped off that old man? 
That poor, I, sweet I am, old man. I am Tractor Zeet now, by the way. Uh, I cut my grass for the first time yesterday. Hey, Tractor Zeet. Are you worried uh, about the football team not being able to play this season because they don't have your money? No, I actually gave them a lot of money and a lot of tips. Tight end tips. I didn't oh, break out. Tight yep. end tips. <laughs> so, oh, you meant like cash tips. Oh, no, no, no. Actual, like, legit good tips. Like, hey, I've been watching like, a lot of film. Yeah. This so, is a block. Yeah, and then they were going to bring other football players uh, next week, but I got the tractor instead. So I think I bought five pads for the team, but it's only time okay. I cut my grass. That's I nice. will say your yard looked much nicer now that you're cutting it with the tractor compared to the football team. I don't think they were doing a great job. Whoa. Well, yeah, they brought like Whoa. six lawnmowers, so th- oh, they were just they were fast nice. with it. But. Looks like they were cutting it with shovels from the uh, <laughs> from how much your tractor had to do. <laughs> What do you mean? <laughs> Your tractor was going to work. It was going to work. It was going to overtime. <laughs> yeah, that's what I mean. Well, this poor old man put a lot of hard-earned hours yeah, and, and blood, sweat, and tears into building this tractor. Yeah. And he he built it? it the and, and then basically lost his job, had to sell it to pay the bills, and Zeke just fucking Low took ball him to the cleaners. So, uh, to, to go into that conversation, <laughs> I'll give you again, wow. like the Satanist, I, I asked too many questions. Okay. I go, when I, it was a Facebook market buy. I went over there, me and Tim. We're talking to the guy. We're talking tractor talk. You brought your muscle to intimidate him. You brought Tim. <laughs> tractor talk. We're having tractor talk. It was more Tim and uh, him. And, Just uh, talking tractors. And then Tim actually walked away, and I was like, what's going on? You upgrading? He was like, no. Nah, you know, uh, I'm going to start pushing, you know? I'm going to start pushing to using the push board. Uh-huh. I was like, oh, sweet. You know, that's pretty cool. Uh, and then he went off and was like, yeah, by the way, uh, I lost my job, so I need the money. And I was like, Jesus, you stole this guy's motor. Yeah. Yeah, wait, why is he pushing instead of the tractor? Because the tractor. Well, he sold his uh, tractor for parts and scrap yeah. basically to Z because he needed a couple extra bucks to put food on the table for his kids. Jesus. Z. Most people yeah. would feel bad. So I, I sent some another, I sent some uh, a Venmo with a little more money. Oh, a little gift. Yeah, to, oh. it was his son's Venmo because he didn't have a Venmo. <laughs> oh, so this guy was 800 years old. <laughs> so no, this guy was a fucking man, dude. He was like 380, 6'7". <laughs> oh, so oh, you know. This guy was massive. So you know the tractor will hold. Did you buy yeah, it, that's Anthony? That's Costanza. how I knew. <laughs> I was like, how's the suspension? I looked at him. I was like, all right, this matches up perfect. You oh, ride this thing? You're going to find this guy in his front yard fucking killed over dead because he's... <laughs> He's not used to fucking pushing a lawnmower and you stole it from him. No, no, no. You know, I, I helped the guy out and I told him, if you ever want it back, just let me know. Talking about getting scammed. Admit, any update on the oh, yeah. uh, scammer? Can we call him on phone here? No, he is not uh, answered or, yeah, I'm not going to hear from that guy. Oh, well. Have you went to your bank and said it was a fraud and you got your money back? I went to my bank. They said it's probably like 60 days for them to even start that. Mm-hmm. And then also. Oh, yeah. that, they do try and discourage you, but you just got to push through. Yeah, yeah. Just say, fucking do it. Yeah, so we're just kind of still doing that. And then also, uh, the I guess some police are on the case. I'm not sure. <laughs> oh, they got them working in shifts. Let's go. <laughs> but, Down there at the crime lab. Yeah, they'll the figure reports. that one out. Yeah, dude. so you I'm stake out. Yeah, no, I have all faith in the world in the uh, IMPD here. So. Shout out. That would be awesome shout if shout they out. caught this uh, scamming dickhead before they caught Bill's hit and run guy. Yeah, we got Bill. Oh, I got yeah. a guy's fucking license plate, the photo of his car, and a photo of the guy. And you have police working on your fucking case for a guy that lives overseas that scammed you for a grand. Oh, I don't know. No, this is really fucked up. Bill, it's insane that you're just fucking finding this I guy. I heard from my detective today. That's it. That's you the are first the detective. Time. Mitt, if you, or Bill, if you think. They're actually looking for Mitt's yeah, fucking... Yeah, you're, you're just a file. Mitt got in any correspondence. This you, is the first time I've think talked he did? to police. They probably fucking just had him talk to the police dog that was sitting next to the phone. Yeah, Mitt could probably okay. called the Scruff McGruff crime <laughs> hotline, and they'd fucking... <laughs> Help me, please. <laughs> Talk a boy on a crime. Fuck, it sounds like dogs, You're doing it, okay. Dude. Thanks. Get it. Get it, you dog. Dude. Uh, <laughs> also, thank you, Doc. <laughs> also, Bill, I, I can't believe Bill isn't taking vigilante justice into his own hand here. Yeah, it feels like they can't find the guy because Bill slid. I his did. I, I, I the found the guy. I found the guy. Took a photo. Flash bombed him. I drove. Bombed him. Flash bombed him. Yeah. Yeah, him. <laughs> Look at my tits. I drove past the guy's car. Took all the photos and everything. Wrote down his address. Gave it to police. Then heard a week later. All right, we'll give you a phone call. That's the that's the most. Bill, they probably got better things to do. Yeah, there's people a hit dying, and run division. Bill. There is a hit and run division of IMDb. Yeah, they there are detectives they that only they cars. work hit and runs. Bill, are you bashing police officers yeah, on what here? Are you doing? What's going on? Wow, Bill. Whoa. I'm bashing IMPD. Yes. Whoa. If you have a hit and run division and you have a hit and run solved in your lap, 
Yikes. I don't know why Officers, you don't Officers, I did not that. say this. Not again. <laughs> Let's get into the FOD because yeah, we can't take any more of that. Bad, yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Do you want the video first? Yeah, yeah, that would that would help. <laughs> or just <laughs> next one. So there was a tiger that got loose over the weekend. Where at Houston? This I think this was in Texas. Texas. Looks like, right. It looked like Houston. And, uh, this guy's Houston. an animal. An off-duty cop just happened to be in the neighborhood. Pulled up. He drew. He drew his gun on the tiger. Tried to persuade this the guy, tiger carefully. I said, "I'm not having any part of this." Uh, well, that's because the cop was taken? yelling, stay inside! Everybody get back inside! It was awesome. Surprisingly, the tiger did not maul his face off. No, the tiger is very nice. I mean, a tiger Wait, knows so the, a tiger. Did he take a shot or no? No, he did not. He did not discharge the weapon. He did not discharge the firearm. Oh, is he, is there he a is. second gun out? He's, no, he's telling everyone, get oh. back inside! There's a tiger out here! <laughs> It is. This video is incredible. And the way the tiger was walking at him, it sure did look like he was gonna rip his face he, off. So I saw another video from a car, and it was like the the, uh, the tiger was like in a, a fighting position. See, this tiger looks like he just wants to get pet to me. That's yeah. what that looks like, dude. That slow walk. Yeah, like hey, I'm about to, I'm coming up to you slowly for a little pet. You can see all my hands. <laughs> so the follow up was. The Tiger's owner identified police as Victor Hugo Cuevas, 26 years old, was taken into custody. Uh, He actually arrived on the scene at the same time police did. Managed to corral the Tiger into his, what is it, a white SUV? Mm -hmm. Drove off. They did a little digging into uh, Mr. Cuevas. Found out he was arrested in July 2020, charged with murder from a 2017 shooting. And he was out on $250,000 bail. Oh, after eating sushi? Hey, there's our guy. The uh, tiger is still on the loose. It turns out it was a, uh, his pet in this neighborhood. So where, so they can't find the tiger? He hid it somewhere. He took it and stashed it somewhere. Well, I'm worried about the tiger. Uh, as you be should right? be. Who, There's only one person we should call right now. Fucking, Who's that? Ghostbusters? Ron, tiger King. Ron Borza. No, I think he's in jail. Tiger's actually. in jail. That's this, this is his way to get out. So you can just get out of jail for murder? 250 you large. 250 large, yeah. Yeah, who so. is this guy? I mean, I mean, he's got a tiger. He's 26. So I'm always confused. Have... You only pay 10% of that, though, right? Mm. So he only has to pay 25000 to get out? No. No, dude, you have to pay that's your a, whole That's thing. a bond. Yeah. Or that's the... Um... Bail, you pay the whole thing. Yeah. Oh, wow. To full 20, I mean, Victor care. Fuego fucking Cuevas is pushing $250,000 bails and... Rolling around with a tiger, he ain't worried about much. I'll this tell you that. Andy, That's what I mean. He's and he's yeah. murdering people. So this guy, <laughs> this guy's That's probably that. fucking badass. This guy might, in fact, be the real Tiger King. Also, could be a dirtbag. Uh, we're not sure. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want a tiger after seeing that, though. Connecting the dots, know. a lot of evidence points to dirtbag. <laughs> dirt we're not yeah. certain, but we'll leave it. You want a tiger after that? Yeah. Tiger was awesome, dude. He was just trying to say hi to everybody. I'm going to guess he's part of the, the cartel. Dude. If I guess. Seat. 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 I think I could say that. Again, Zito connecting the dots. Zito, you may be allowed to say that. I'm just allowed to connect dots every once in a while, Tony. Okay. It looks like Final you did there. Do. No well, spoilers. What's next? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, uh, uh, so. Bail. This was a mysterious uh, picture that was sent in. Of the uh, company parking lot, and it does appear to be a Chevy Trail, uh, Chevy, Chevy Trail Boss. Is that what it is? That's a Trail Boss. Folks. It's called Trail, trail Boss. With no, uh, there is no power washer in the back, though, conspicuously absent. And oh, then, uh, I mean, all I see here is just like pure optimized fucking streamlined performance versus a big, bulky, dumb fucking truck. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> if, if you didn't tell me that was a truck, I would think that's an SUV. By it looking does at it. look a bit. Mickey Mouse from now, the front listen, I got a new, gr- I, I got a new grill on the way. The grill a little bit Mickey That's, Mouse. Bill, yeah. I didn't send uh, this Jay in, said that it's got it's kind of <laughs> got an underbite. You know, <laughs> it does have an underbite. I was just thinking. So that. there's a couple things that you know can be tuned here. But you bought a new grill. I did buy a new grill. Interesting. Yeah. Like a uh, like one that goes on top of it. Uh, That's no, like, like metal, like the bar. It looks like, like a frowny gonna, face. I'm going to pull that one out, put a new one in. It's got like a light bar across it. It's nice. Be cooler if you bought a grill that goes into the hitch. Yeah, and then yeah. you tailgated with yeah, a that barbecue grill. Uh, so this weekend, oh. whenever I tweeted about having to uh, cook a brisket, 
Yeah, you uh, a lot of people told pill. me to just buy a smoker when I live in an apartment that has no outside access, so I can't really. No, have put a it in the bed of your Mickey Mouse truck. Well, yeah. they have <laughs> smokers you can actually attach to your Engine. hitch. Oh. There we go. And you now we're talking. It, it, you do that, the truck so. becomes a little less Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Can you drive around while smoking meats? Oh, yeah. I, I've actually I seen it. We should try. I've they have smokeless it. grills, by the way, Bill. You could buy not one a, of those. Not a smoker, though. Oh, a smoker. Yeah. Smokeless smoker. Yeah, smokeless smoker. What's a smokeless grill? It's well, just George a Foreman? you can use inside. No, we thought we were talking convection. Yeah. Sure. Nice convection oven yeah. versus you, conviction. Yeah, I you should just put that pulled pork in uh, what is that air fryer? It'd be fine. How was that brisket, Bill? It was uh, pretty, pretty delicious. You know, just put it in the crock pot, let it go for about six, seven hours, and uh, uh, you got some delicious tacos. It looked better than the slop you've been eating in the office, Tony. How much better do you <laughs> feel? Slop I've been eating in the office has been seeing <laughs> Nick, food. your truck sitting so, up side by side. Don't even start. We call it a truce. I don't. I'm not oh, you even got the front hitch. A truce. I'm not going to do those front hitches I'm right here. Yeah, to pull them out of a ditch and every fucking breaks down. I'm oh, not <laughs> that doesn't sound like a truce to me. Oh, I'm he not. Seems I'm like not going to. I'm stating the fact. Well, Bill's a scumbag. I'm not. So that's fair. <laughs> I mean, this you is don't pretty punch. damning. You don't I'll let it be known. Like we accepted your truce. This was not sent in by me. This was not sent in by anyone else nope. here. Not me. I don't punch in the studio currently. It was the only person who's not here. I will say, whenever I walked outside and I realized that like our, our <laughs> wheel wells are at the same height and then how much more he has on top of me, that I was probably missing a little bit of truck. Yeah, he has a second deck it. on that thing. Let's go. Good looking truck, Bill. Is there four doors on Good both these truck. cars? Yes. Really? Oh, yeah. I, I mean, how Bill, I like bed? it. How Tone? big's the bed? You got a four-foot bed? What are we talking about? How big's your bed, Tone? Answer. Oh, big yes. enough, dude. <laughs> oh, big enough to fit your truck in it is what he said. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he just said, Bill. What's next? Okay, here we go. Good God. <laughs> this is a paragraph. Let's get through it. This oh, might be a possible question for Tactical Dicks. Last weekend, He's my dead. roommate and I had some friends <laughs> over. It's about 930 at night. While we were listening to music and talking, we heard an extremely loud pop. Boom. First thought that was thank you that was good. First thought that was the neighbor's kid threw a firecracker over the fence so at he's the a dog. Piece, that's a piece of shit. That <clears throat> is a piece of shit. Nope. Turns out the idiot was cleaning his hunting rifle and it fired a round straight out his windowsill directly into our home. Jesus. Oh, shit. Luckily, no one was hurt. The only damage was some busted up siding. He came, and told us, and said sorry, but we couldn't even bring ourselves to be mad because of how dumb this guy was and how shocked we were when it happened. How guys? How would you guys handle someone firing an accidental round into your home? I think it's only fair you get to return fire. Yeah, you shoot one back. Uh, yeah, you say I like no. You go to the guy's house, be like, "Hey, we're gonna do it back. To hide wherever you want in your house. Yeah, <laughs> get down, get in the closet, <laughs> maybe the bathtub, probably a bathtub. We're gonna send one across your bow. <laughs> See what happens. I think I'd ask for the gun. Give me that. That gun's mine now. Give me that gun. In the state of Ohio, and you then you sign your papers. I think that's where he Listen, shoots you. Then you gotta be real well, idiot. He's going to jail forever. To leave a bullet in there when you're cleaning your gun. Mine, I was fucking. I was actually on. Scrambling. You were I, playing James Bond. I was on duty. <laughs> <laughs> I was playing James Bond. You're not going to play James Bond with a fucking non loaded weapon. <laughs> Blank or not. <laughs> Blank or not. <laughs> don't matter. Mine, legitimate. This guy, don't be an idiot. Don't be an idiot. It'd be cool if it fucking came through and, like, busted your fish tank and then the fish were flopping all over the floor yeah the they, you, get, yeah, you can make them pay for it get some nice new exotic fish yeah, yeah give me two wrongs don't make it right you know I mean? oh, there you go. oh so you're saying don't return fire nah just fuck guy was a dummy made a mistake no one got hurt carry on fucking buy, like, buy him a couple cases just like of when beer connor dude. and zeke shot their neighbor in the leg no he fucking <laughs> popped himself but if uh <laughs> if you do get hit by this guy what ha do you take this dude to the cleaners Yes. So you get yeah. shot in the oh, leg. Yeah. I, I don't. Yeah, you're not paying for it, dude. You didn't fire the fucking bullet. No, I mean, like, are you taking all? <laughs> yes, man. Okay, thank you. But are you fucking taking all of his money? Yes. I what, think it's like fair. Fifth degree murder. Okay, you shot me. No, you, you flesh wound. Or no, what's it called when it's like semi murder? Well, you play it up. Third degree. You know? No, like when it's like manslaughter. No. no. Manslaughter is if they don't die. Accidental it manslaughter. Is, right? Accidental manslaughter. Yeah. Nope. So accidentally they don't One die. of the degrees You're is, talking about degrees of homicide? One of the degrees is no, I, I don't know. One's premeditated, I mean, one's an accident. Yeah, first degree, I believe, is premeditated. What's, yeah. Third is accident. Yes. What's second, like, kind of planned it? That's what. That's where we get into the gray area. I think where, second was like a, like a dude. <laughs> <laughs> I was cleaning my gun, and they were in the line of sight. Second degree! And, uh, well, I'm sure you guys will work it out. Yeah, yeah you'll be fine. What's next? Make a move. Uh, let's see. 
Oh, ho, ho, I like this. A Call of Duty teaser all but confirms that Rambo, John Rambo, Whoa. is coming to Warzone in Black Ops Cold War. Whoa! How come that doesn't look like Stallone enough? Did they try to fuck around? That's how he looked in the There movies. is just a little bit of something that doesn't have Stallone in that guy's face. I know Do we think saying. they didn't pay for the rights and they just had to change like the face uh, It's kind of like the Queen and Vanilla Ice situation where the dun 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 What's bum, going bum, on here? Bum, bum. Yeah. Wasn't he just in Mortal Kombat? Who? Yeah. John Rambo. Rambo. Yeah. I like that he's pimping himself out to these games. Is Rambo he was in the, Is he in Fortnite yet? I didn't see no, Rambo was in, in the Fortnite. movie. What part? No, he was uh, in the game. In the last game. game. Yeah, they just they've been throwing like Terminator in. in there. Uh, Rambo and, like, shouldn't stand a, a chance in fucking things. Mortal Kombat. Who who makes this money? Sylvester? <laughs> Sylvester. I do I believe know. Sly gets a rather large <laughs> cut. You think so? <laughs> Does look like him. Sylvester the cat? All Stallone. That's right. That's what I'm saying. I think they're trying to rob Sly because they, you know it kind of looks like him. But did he direct Rambo like he did Rocky? Are did those his? Are the those last his? Rambo was fucking incredible. Have, by the way, was it? I still haven't seen blood? it, dude. It was so good. I'm gonna assume he still gets a rather large. No, cut Ted Kotcheff directed Rambo. Uh, Ted Is he related to Sylvester. Nah. <laughs> still all of them Kotcheff. did. Still do the last one. I'm sure he did. You want me to look? Yeah, if you don't mind. While we have you. <laughs> yeah, please. I'll, I'll be here all episode. If we're being honest. Hell yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. I mean, while What's next? Here. We'll come back to it. We'll circle back to that. Circle back. Uh, what we have here is a video of a chimpanzee in Russia. I believe this is answering the door and paying for a uh, pizza delivery. It's quite disturbing to watch, honestly. It's, tr it's dressed like a high school teenager. Yeah, I don't like what happened here. It it flawlessly hands over the cash and takes the pie. Exactly. What was that Disney movie where the monkey is like? I mean, shout Dustin out to checking in. Dunstan checks MVP, in. most valuable primate. How about? I'm sorry, but this is so fake. What do you mean? I am sorry, but this isn't real, boys. I watched about? this eight Why times. Is that There's no chance. Wearing gloves. That, that's yeah, what I mean. That's walking like a. Also, it's walking like a person. It's not walking. So like you a think that's a bingo. person there? Well, yes. hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Watch it walk back. No, seriously, just watch it walk backwards, though. And it, also, the gloves, I think, is what does it for me. And, like, the shoes. Yeah, like, look at that thing, dude. That thing's fake as hell. Mitt, what are you... Know, not at no the way point. he hands the cash. I, I follow Monkey yeah. Daily on Twitter. <laughs> on the there it is, Do man. not walk like this. They do Thank not walk you, like this. Thank you, Mitt. Thank you. do not walk like this. <laughs> That's right. I mean, you can't argue with that. What, yeah. kind, of, what kind of content can but we like, expect from Monkey Daily? <laughs> Dude, it's out. Oh, it's, dude, it's awesome. It? They like yeah. eat strawberries and stuff. Connor, you follow it too? Oh yeah, it is actually awesome. All right, well, I will defer to the monkey experts in look, the room. Then it's just yeah. it's the way his arms look. It's the gloves. It is. There's so many different. What about things. the head though? The head looks very real. Oh yeah, this it, monkey's jack. That dude. was probably a super. Look, I mean, look at him backing up. That just it's just not real. Uh, so slide directed the 2008 Rambo. <laughs> okay. okay, good to know. That's what I thought. Yeah. All right. Look at us. We're, we're fucking cracking cases. <laughs> moving right now. Fake monkey, and we got slide on. What's next? Uh, oh, oh, yeah. Dude. Uh, this was the giant glass bridge in China that faced, what, 100-mile-an-hour yeah. winds, and the glass shattered. <laughs> While some dude was on it. No. While this dude hung on for dear life. Yep. Dude, is he alive? Yeah, he uh, he awesome. crawled to safety, which I guess he just gripped onto the rods on the side there and crawled himself oh, to uh, some Can't rescue trust workers. It. That's why I never went in that fucking um, building in Chicago. Oh, so you're stopping. The Willis That's Tower? Not, yeah, oh, the Willis the Tower. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, first of all, this guy's an asshole for fucking walking on a glass bridge when there's 100 mile True. per hour winds. So if you're walking on a glass bridge, you're going when it's clear as day. Is this next to the Great Wall of China? Um, is it like above it? It's like uh, it's like a it's like fifty miles away from it. It kind of looks like the same area. It's a though. sweet looking bridge. It's in the uh, Shangxi yeah. province. Oh. I've been to the Great Wall of China. They built that to uh, get true. Genghis Khan Have away. you been to this? Oh, those are photos of it. Oh, no, I've never been to this shit because I don't fuck with glass bridges, dude. Yeah, I don't fuck with glass bridges either. At all. I don't want to see down. I don't fuck down. with glass anywhere, really. What's the saying? Never throw a rock at a glass uh, house. Bridge, never glass throw a, ne Never throw a rock inside a glass house. Don't throw stones. When Maybe you're living you make in a glass like uh, one or two of these squares glass, just yeah. for shits and gigs. Yeah, I like. Maybe that. we don't need That's to make the whole idea. bridge floor out of glass. When I uh, when I went on the sky deck for the Sears Tower, I thought I cracked it. Willis Tower? No, it's Sears well, Tower. Where's the Sears Tower? Shaitan. 
really? Let me look. Let I look never it. heard of it. Yeah, up. look it up. I never heard of the Sears Tower. I'll I'll pop up right away, actually, if you look it up. Sears oh, it's weird. Tower. A couple days ago, or a couple years ago, I went to Chicago and I uh, yeah, went to the Willis Tower. Yeah, oh, mate, you went to the Willis I've heard yeah. of the Willis Tower. Oh, uh, you no, went dude, to a Mickey Mouse Tower. When you Google dude. Sears Tower, Chicago, the Willis Tower pops up. Did no, you mean that's Willis the one Tower? That, yeah, that's the Sears Tower. That's the one that you can you can look down. You know, when they when they built it, they based it off of cigarettes. It's still Sears to me, damn it. You know who you could blame for this? Fucking that one guy. Kardashians, dude. And Sears. They put, they put their line of clothing in Sears, and then Sears immediately went out of business. Get out of here. That's Gumpy. true. Gumpy used to work at yeah, Sears. Yeah, that's where I started my working career. Shout out Sears. Yeah, yeah. fucking treat him well. Great home appliances. Yeah. My old man used Not to work well at enough. Sears. Hell yeah. Great home appliances. He was place. a security guard. Hell yeah, some good stories out of Sears My mom there. was a manager there he, for years and fuck years. Fuck yeah, dude. Good he, fucking benefits. He tackled a guy in the parking lot, drove up to him in his Trans Am, dove out, tackled him. Guy was stealing a VCR. <laughs> That's gotcha, yeah. bitch. Pretty cool. Well, you still have that Trans Am? Still really fucking cool. Yeah, Sears Tower, baby. Shout out Willis. Shout, Shout out, out Willis. Sears. Sears. What's next? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, here He's we go. Scroll on in this. So Mickey Rourke apparently oh, just discovered oh, yeah. Law and Order, SVU. <laughs> and uh, he wrote a oh, diatribe on the Instagram caption. This is, if you go to Mickey Rourke's Instagram, you can see it. I'll, I'll give you this brief synopsis here at the beginning. I've heard this show has been on for 20 years. <laughs> I never knew anything about it before until lockdown since I have all my gym equipment in my living room. Shout out Mickey for still working out. Six oh, months yeah. ago, while I've been doing all my training at home, <laughs> isolated. Yeah, way to pat yourself Thank on the you, back Mickey. there, Mick. Thank you. I click on this show just by accident. I seen Curiosity, I have to say, I've never seen such a terrific acting ever on television. <laughs> Each show that I've seen, and I've probably seen a thousand of them by now, the producing is terrific. The direction is top class, and most of all, I'm really impressed with the ensembles of highly talented actors. Is it Dick Wolf who does this? I do believe it is Dick Wolf. He goes on to praise Maloney, yeah. Ice T. What do you say about cast. Ice T? Uh, if you scroll down, we can see. Uh, there it is. Geez. What does he say about Ice T? Ice T. He goes uh, tremendously impressed with the charisma, the attitude, and swag and sincerity that Ice T brings to this particular role. Especially enjoying is watching Commodity. <laughs> Of all this exceptional group of actors. And if you scroll down to the very bottom, he takes a shot at Marvel. Uh, <laughs> respect to all of you. <laughs> the work that all you do is real acting, not like that crap, that all on that Marvel shit. He's a part of Marvel. <laughs> he, he was in a Marvel movie. <laughs> is he mad they killed his character off? Oh, they, they didn't kill it off. A lot of people say it's one of the worst Marvel movies. I'm not blaming that on What, Mick. Iron Man 3? Two. He was in two. For some reason, I thought Mickey Rourke was the wrestler he oh, was the wrestler i thought he, he was the wrestler the fighter from uh but that was he's got Lord. lightning stuff in iron man yeah um do we know this guy's did he only watch svu isn't there another one i don't know i was hoping you guys i know this i've is never your, seen uh, one episode alley. of law and order i am on that boat i've never seen one yeah, episode law and of law and order is good it always ends in, dick wolf makes a good product svu is definitely the best one the most that i've no ever watched no fucking way you watch law and order bum, dude bum. yeah i do what? You say you watch cartoons and documentaries. Yeah, I believe you watch CSI Law and, and like Law and Order and CSI Law and Order Miami. Miami and shit. I've seen Miami. Miami's not that good. I bet you Mitt stayed at home a lot and watched all these. I'm things. sick. The day, uh, oh, dude, Did you say CSI Miami's not that good? It's not. Horatio nah, stinks. Dude, it kind of stinks. You guys stink. Oh, God, Those crimes are all rage. Mickey Mouse. Which one's LL Cool J in? Come on, dude. Which one is LL Cool J in? Not in uh, CSI. Uh, NCIS. In yeah, NCIS. I just heard over my shoulder. Not the same one. Come on, guys. You like They're NCIS? No, I hate them all. Yeah, all these shows. NCIS. NCIS. Yeah. CSI. Well, why don't you like them? Just CSI Miami was great. Do you think it's no. like a bogus plot line, or you just Stinks. fucking hate them? Or? Uh, it's more so. There's just no ending. You know, it's just it's uh, one so of those you, shows that go on You don't on watch forever. it as if it's just like a, like it's just on TV. I'm gonna watch an episode. Exactly. Do you, you want to watch? I'll do that with many. Which one is? So uh, like you only watch serial like apps like serial TV shows or whatever. You don't watch just like serial serial killers. Serial. Yeah, there you go. Thank you. Z. <laughs> no, I watch all <laughs> kinds of shows, mate. <laughs> Hold on. What did he mean by serial <laughs> serial killers? No, I, it's it's like a it's just like a term that I fucking learned in school. It doesn't matter. But uh, <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Now it matters. Episodic. <laughs> no, like, is it? Do you only watch like episodic you mean a like, series TVs? Well, that's it's called like a serial, like Look television show. Serial drama. Is that, is that what real? you're trying to say, man? Yeah. Is, is it because you eat it with your cereal? Okay. Um, <clears throat> which one is Winchell in? I see him running Mike around the, the New Orleans Bayou in one of them. It's something oh, yeah. New Orleans. Uh, 
I Hawaii think it's NCIS yeah, yeah, yeah. New Orleans. Yeah. Hawaii Five-0. I think Jay might be the Was biggest fucking guy. Jay, 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 Jay loves Law and Order, dude. Jay, you can tell Jay's so mad right now. He's oh, got his he's, head buried in his hands just he, listening. He's so pissed. He says he sees the commercials, but we all know he watches Yeah, yeah. sure, Jay. Okay, Jay. He said he hasn't watched any of them. Said, he said Horatio Kane is brilliant. <laughs> he said he's the worst. He just said he's the What's that? Oh, what? Is this? Oh wait, no. Let's let's peel back this oh, let's layer. Go, What's going Diggs. on with Big Sky? <clears throat> let's go, Diggs. Come on, getting it from everyone it's else today. Why not? Come on. Come on. No, Horatio are you saying it stinks? Not. That's why he likes that tree show. Okay. And there's those corny one-liners. Oh. <gasps> That's his gimmick, dude. If you don't understand the gimmick, you don't appreciate the work. I don't know the show. I don't think I want I don't Rebottle, know. please. Nah, there isn't one. What's next? Well, it's getting it's getting hostile in here. It seems like it's Do, a is there sound on this one? Can we get sound? Yeah. Oh, shit. Dude, Somebody. What the fuck is that? The guy barbecue. who robbed Mint when he said that he was calling the cops. <laughs> Somebody. It's barbecue night. Oh my god, it's a bat. Burgers. Get out. It's not a bat. Dude. It's a kangaroo. Come on, get out. Come on. Is that Dango? The Dango hit my baby. That is uh, a, a possum, not, not an opossum, just a possum Burgers. down under in Australia in some guy's grill. Mick goes, that's a fucking bat, dude. Oh, that was a bat. I don't know why. We're supposed to take monkey advice from Mitt. This guy thinks a possum is a bat. <laughs> that's not an opossum, dude. I've seen opossums. I know. I told you it's not an opossum. Uh, it's a possum. What is it? Oh, they're different from the United States? Opossum. Look it up. This thing's like a small possum. I didn't, I didn't know that. No, it's an opossum. So there's opossum, there's possums? I don't know if I'm right either. I was just reading the comments underneath the tweet. Opossum is the name of the animal. A possum is a different thing. What is that then? That's a separate animal. I'm looking at the. Are there two different animals? Do we have a possum and an opossum? Yeah, there's an opossum and a possum. I'm looking right now. Think about that, Mitt. I'll be honest. I didn't know Australia had either of them. Uh, is it? I'm so fucking lost. So it's an opossum, and then oh, it's yeah, a yeah. possum. There you go. Look at you. Is that it? Uno yeah. possum. Yeah, yeah people are calling them possums. Opossums live in North America, while possums live in Australia and other countries. Look at that. The more you know. We're Both animals stuff. are marsupials, but possums are more closely related to kangaroos. So I was right about it. It's a kangaroo. I could definitely beat the shit out of a possum. Yeah, he's <laughs> oh, yeah. Tiny little fucker. Oh, as we're on that, I saw this video of a Komodo dragon <laughs> in a in a fucking restaurant. This girl was just dragging it by its tail, yeah, whipping you were it that around. Me, dude. I was really? saying I could beat yeah. the shit out of that. I thing, was saying dude. that, and you were disagreeing with wow. me. Wow, I didn't see. No, that no, video. no. I was yeah. on your side. Me no, and you, you were both were. saying that we could kill it, and then they were saying that we couldn't. Why did I remember you, why saying did you could. bring in this visual evidence so we could discuss it on yeah, the show. I don't know. I just totally, totally blew my mind. But oh, so feels you fake. made it up? Yeah, it feels fake. No, 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 no. I swear it was awesome. No, it was dude, in my life. I swear you're lying. Dude, I watch Komodos daily, every day on Twitter. That was <laughs> okay. No, I, I did like it. I might have even actually sent it to. Uh, I don't know. God, I gotta get to my Twitter. Give me a second. It's hard. I, I don't know, Mitt. I just don't think you can do it, man. No, but, dude, it was awesome. I spell Komodo. No K clue. O M O D O. Sound it out. Komodo. Sound it out, Z. Dude, let me find it. Girl drags Komodo would work. <laughs> Girl drags. <laughs> this is awesome. We might get into a weird part of the internet here looking for this. You ain't gonna find it, dude. Oh my god, what is that? That is porn, guys. Look away. Girl drags Komodo. What if this is a girl just verbally berating a Komodo? <laughs> Be sweet. You stink. Make it beat you up. I hate you. <laughs> You're so ugly. Oh, here it is. You oh, here stupid we go. Komodo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think we can show it, though. No, we can't. That thing's tiny, dude. That's, yeah, a, that's, 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 Jesus, not, that's dude. a two week old Komodo dragon. Yeah, that's what we're moving, saying, though. It has though, no base at a young age. Dude, well. you don't think that you could just kill that thing? I could. It's a baby, shit, dude. It's a baby. Thing. Yeah, you could kill the baby of any animal. Cool, dude. You, you, yeah. you think that's, that's cool not being a baby, baby killer? That's a baby, man. That thing is not a baby. Yes, it teenager is, at dude. Best. I'll take yeah, teenager. No. Go to the video. Go to the video of that Komodo dragon in the fucking Bangkok CBS. And that thing is a full-grown Komodo dragon. Okay? 
Don't be a fucking idiot. Yeah, I can still kill that thing too. There's a no. A full size Komodo yeah. dragon is eight to nine feet and about two hundred pounds. That yeah. look eight to nine feet. I got a hundred on it, dude. That look eight to nine feet. Bitch. Did it look two hundred pounds? <laughs> yeah, dude. That Didn't. thing. It's those things are like dinosaurs, dude. They're not that big. Dude, we got. Think you could beat up weights. dinosaurs, Mitt? You too. They're all there. little chicken sizes. Yeah. I'm so look at that thing. That, that is a full grown Komodo dragon. Okay, Mitt. You can put that on the screen. Here you go. That ain't that Mickey Mouse Komodo dragon that lady was dragging out. You think a, that lady would, could drag this thing out? Yes. Yeah, yeah right. I Use do. your dude, brain, dude. I dude, their do. main power comes from their tail. You take their tail out, you you win. How are you taking their tail out? I mean, you, you grab it. This grab thing. it, dude. Did you not see that girl? Yeah, that was baby a baby, mix. you moron. It's not yeah, a girl. And that girl was probably like 16. What? A little 16 year old. That's like, not waitress. true. That's not true. Look at the dude. This yes. thing doesn't have any core strength. It can't even get up there. That dude. thing. Yeah, what dude. He's trying. He can't even about? climb. It just climbed that entire thing. It's straight up. Uh, I took him like five minutes. Well, let's, soft, I mean, let's dude. get the whole story. The video is thirty seconds. They can get up to twelve mph. They can get moving. I'm yeah, faster than that. Yeah. For how long? Yeah, but you're fighting it. You're I not can running. Definitely run way faster. It, now. You're it's, oh, you're running away from it now. It's an octagon type fight. They can you dive. I'll fucking throw him over the octagon wall. They dude. can dive up to fifteen feet in water. They can climb. Yeah. Well, good water. thing I can't swim anyway. And they can climb trees. Oh, so water fight, you lose no matter what. Tree fight, you lose no matter what. Yeah, he's not going to be able to climb that tree when I'm pulling his tail down and fucking stepping on his throat. Well, it's not running away from you. They can eat 80% of their weight in one sitting, so they could definitely scarf down mid. Yeah. Zeke's going to be tough. Yeah, mm -hmm. but fucking. I'll two sittings, my... though. Uh, <laughs> he could do two. Two sittings. Probably. I would put my Maybe. foot in his mouth. <laughs> I would even do the fucking King Kong and rip his mouth open. He ain't doing it. No dude. way. Yeah, dude. You oh, put yeah. your hands in that mouth, kiss them goodbye. It's like an alligator. An alligator can't fucking close their mouth after. I oh, know. Which one is it? Once it's closed, you ain't getting it open. Uh, they're Dangerous venomous? Did we know this? Did we talk about this? No. That they're venomous? Oh, okay, right. Mitt, how are you going to okay, do that? Okay, no. Dude? That's a game changer. I'm out. No, no this is nope. what you said Too last late. time, Too and late. I said I could still fucking kill this thing. I'm out. You guys are both wrong. Is uh, it in their nails or in their mouth? It's both. in the mouth. People thought that it was... The bite was so dangerous because of the massive amount of bacteria. So people just thought they had stank breath. But it turns out in 2009, they found out through some research that uh, Komodo dragons, unlike a snake, which injects venom into a victim through a sharp fangs, Komodo's dragon venom seeps into large wounds it makes on whatever lucky animal oh, attacks. Oh, yeah, he ain't going to fucking get at me, dude. <laughs> so they scratch you and bite no, you. Yeah. Force. And then they spit venom in your wounds. Later. Yeah, dude. I'll, I'll fucking I'll spit his kind mouth. words for you at your funeral. <laughs> Later. Yeah, You're take dead. my spit, dead. dude. Dead. 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 I'm probably just going to pick up a rock. Dead. Oh. Then, I'm surprised you're not joining me on this side. I, I think it'd be easier to take one of these things than a kangaroo. Well, no, no. Yeah. Here's the, this is the kicker here. Uh, built of thousands of tiny bones under the skin, which serve as an armor. Yeah, yeah dude. dude. I'm going to fucking crush those bones. bones. Well, man, uh, you can't backtrack and then unbacktrack and then backtrack <laughs> again, okay? I still... You're out. Right. Yeah. I think I could kill it. He's bad. Well, I don't know. If Maybe. Rock, it goes back to what I always say about the kangaroo. Maybe in a one-on-one -on -one life or death situation, does it have you, a might, throat? you might get him once, but does if it it's like... Throat? Does it have a throat? It, it does have a throat? If it's like best two out of three, you ain't, You're you dead. ain't doing it. Yeah. You lose a Mortal Kombat. So basically, I'm not going to go to the, the King Kong move. I'm going to keep mouth shut the whole time. You're going to have to. Yeah, I think you choke slam it. Because you may yeah. win the battle yeah. and lose the war. I just need a Courtney to fucking uh, fucking suck out the, the fucking Venomot. You need a what? I don't know. It's a reference from a movie. He said a, a Corgi? That's what it sounded like. Damn it, Courtney. <laughs> <laughs> suck my Venom. <laughs> what movie is that? Yeah, what? Your Highness. Your Highness. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. I don't remember what it was from. <laughs> suck his <the> Venom. <laughs> and James Franco. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, Courtney! You know I don't like triangle faces. It's also a dirt bag. <laughs> just, to, just to clarify, what's next? Oh, I can't believe I pulled the fucking. Oh, here we go. Leonardo DiCaprio, new Scorsese film. He looks unrecognizable. No, that's him right there. Yeah, I got him. I found him. I found him. He's right there. Don't be stupid. Did anyone actually go into the article? Was there more to this, or was it just really just the stupid fucking headline? I don't think anybody went into it. Let me click it. Uh, oh, that's a cool shawl that she's wearing. Huh? I didn't. It looks good. I what mean, this is what movie is this? Movie. I don't know. What is the movie? All the killers and the flowers. He's got two movies like coming out. Oh, it's just the white, I the Chicago. So. Um, no, that killer? is a uh, Red Devil in a White City, but they haven't uh, started filming that. I don't think they bought the rights for it like years ago. Yeah, I remember. But this is a different one. It's about like a 
farmer in Oklahoma, I'm pretty sure, somewhere, and he falls in love with this girl, but uh, either the girl or the guy's family what rejects him. I don't know. It's all messed up. What do they up. inject them with? It looks Reject. Like, excuse me. Oh, sorry. Salisbury steak? That does look like Salisbury steak. Oh, it was steak. cranberry yeah. sauce. Yeah. Oh, it actually Could does be. Because like the there's a spoon. Too. And those are beans. It's a western. Yeah. So the beans fit. Killers of the flower moon. There it is. Killers of the flowers. Hey, I was right there. Very, 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 very yeah, close. Good. good job. It's in Oklahoma. Yep. Oklahoma. Let's go. Three for three. I did read the fucking article. Man, it sounds awfully boring, but it I does. will give it a shot because it's Scorsese. You know when there's uh, And because it's boring, it'll be an Oscar nom. Yeah, it will be. Okay. Oh, I did watch a movie this weekend. Here we go. What do you got? Accidentally, uh, when I was renting Nobody, accidentally rented Nomad. <laughs> okay. Oh. Which What's is, no man? Which won Best Picture? Yeah, that sure. lady uh, from Three Billboards. Yes, over in Big Missouri. Which one? Yeah, Three Billboards. Oh, Frances McDormand. Yeah, so she. she yeah, won, she's awesome. She, from she, Fargo. She, yes, I, I believe she won Best Actress this year for Nomad. I think. I think you're right. So actually, like artistically, and how it was shot and stuff like that, very good movie. Magnificent. The story, and <laughs> keeping your attention it stinks. Very boring. Yeah. It looked like one of those movies from like <laughs> everything they showed during the Oscars, uh, but hey, I heard they do have. If awesome you need shots. a good artsy movie, yeah, that's gonna no bad your almost, film. almost put you to sleep. Okay, no mad's the one. Oh, Le- the other movie Leo's doing. Don't look up. Uh, black comedy with Adam McKay and J Law. It's got Je- Jennifer Lawrence. Adam McKay's uh, Will Ferrell's friend. Yep. Yeah, Succession, which I'm also watching again. Rewatch it's hilarious. I mean, watch, watch the, the boys, boys dude. dude. Yeah, just watch it, dude. Hey, look, if, if I want to watch some Mickey Mouse cartoons, do I'll watch the boys. It's not a cartoon. <laughs> okay. Listen, I don't get this, because you're not Ty. <laughs> you watch all the superhero movies. This I do. Like, these are, like, more badass than the Marvel stuff, because they fucking... Whoa, oh, who are you, fucking... Yeah, what are you wearing, your birches today? More badass than the Marvel movies, huh? Who yeah, a lot of F-bombs. So you talk, are you talking who are you to me or him? What? Who oh, because I'm I'm not Mickey putting Rourke? down Marvel movies. I'm just saying. <laughs> what are you the wrestling? <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. I need to give the boys a shot. It's on Amazon. Right. Carl Last Urban's time, dropping dude. dropping c words. Left Carl. and right. Oh, yeah. That goddamn wow. show. And there's boobies everywhere. Carl. I'll give yeah. it a run. I'll try the boys. You said it last Thank time. You. I say it right until now. Until you do it. Until you do it. I'll, I'll say it right now. I will watch an episode of the boys in the next month. What happens if you don't? Who cares? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not pushing on you anymore. I'll let Mitt slap me in the face Hell if yeah. I don't. I Hell actually like yeah. that. Let's go. From, from what's what's today? What's the day? Uh, today is May 11th. This episode comes out May 12th. All right, June 11th. I have to watch an episode of The Boys. Thank you. Someone remind me on June 10th. <laughs> <laughs> I have to watch an episode of The Boys. Well, only one episode, not the two seasons. No, just one episode. Hmm. And it'd be rewatching the first one I watched with you. <laughs> so, well, I guess start somewhere. What's next? Uh, yep, of course. Oh, there you go. Tony sent this in. So who is this in the boys? Soldier Boy? I think he might be a new character. This fucking guy's in the boys? Are you kidding me? I don't think so. I don't know what's going on. They said this on the set of the boys, or did I read did I get confused and just read Soldier Boy? Soldier Boy's in the boys? That this would be electric. <laughs> That's how you should have sold me. They spelled his name wrong. Though. The boys season three, <laughs> Jensen Ackles reports bearded for Soldier Boy duty. Oh, so he's playing oh. a character called Soldier Boy. Yeah. Or Soldier Who's Boy. Who's Jensen Eccles? Don't know. Soldier. I was just pumped that the fucking boys season three was filming. Hell yeah. He better be walking around with step by step. Toy Soldier be, Boy. should be fucking, fucking Homelander, dude. Jensen Eccles was on the CW horror series Supernatural. Oh, man. Oh, this yeah, is going to be tough. That. This is gonna be, <laughs> it's a tough sell after this conversation, boys. Don't don't judge it by its past. Judge it for its future. Jensen Eccles. Hell yeah. What do we got there? <laughs> Write that down. He had a recurring role in Dawson's Creek. Oh, this guy's been oh dude, oh, Dawson's Creek. Creek. He did Smallville. Oh, he hit okay. up all the... I love Smallville. This guy's right up your alley, Tone. I don't know what you're talking about. Was he on Burn Notice? I love Smallville. He looks a lot different. Than Somebody save me! <laughs> that fucking song on every intro. That's a good show. Now, that is something is I can watch. the show we're talking about. Yeah. Is it bad? I've never seen Dawson Creek. I really missed it as well. No, not really. uh, it, it a, I don't about think the, anyone uh, in here probably watched it. Oh. I watched Dawson's Creek when I was a kid. 
I mean, who's the main, who's Dawson's Creek again? What's that guy's name? Vanderbeek. Uh, yeah. Vanderbeek. Uh, one time they were film, uh, filming a movie in my neighborhood, and Vanderbeek had to uh, pull his Skulls. police car into my driveway. What? That's a real story. I swear oh. to God. I was hanging out in the. I swear. I was hanging out in the backyard, and this fucking guy comes walking down the driveway. And I was in like eighth grade, so I was like, who the hell are you, dude? And he was like, hey, I'm a director in this movie. We'd love to use your house in the movie. Uh, like, are your parents around? And I was like, yeah, they're around. You need an extra, dude? And uh, they ended up using the driveway. That's a real story. We need to, What movie? You can find the movie. And look up Dawson's Creek, whatever movies he's been in. He's a cop in this fucking movie. I swear. What's yeah, if you pull it up on here. I mean, Vanderbeek. He yeah, hasn't been in I, a ton, but he's been a good bit of movies. He hasn't. Vanderbeek. Taken in broad daylight. Uh, if I see the movie poster. Was it around 2009? Uh, I th- yeah, 2009. Was LeVar Burton in the movie? Maybe. <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't know. Was Tony Zappa in the movie? Uh, Law and Order is popping up right Final now. Final Draft? There, there's been a Stolen. few. Our movie, uh, the neighborhood that uh, I live in, the Kevin Hart in The Rock actually did a... Uh, movie on the street over they're hanging out in this house in central intelligence that movie central oh. intelligence well, where was taken well, part of the movie in broad daylight films uh that's when they're in this house i don't know <laughs> yeah it, but this is all serious hey i'm not bullshit 2013 he was officer treadwell in labor day there it is labor day that's the one that's the one <laughs> so i wasn't in eighth grade but that is i, I was in high school <laughs> Senior Josh school. Brolin was there? Josh Brolin was in it. Yep. <laughs> what? Toby McGuire? Toby McGuire. Yep. Kate Wins. Kate Wins. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, the department says movie. With that time, J.K. Simmons? Josh Brolin's like on the run or something. He goes and see Kate Winslet and they take him in and he like bonds with the kid and the cop who Did is Dawson's Creek. Did dump out her boobs in your driveway? I wish. Dawson's Creek. Yeah. Hey, you don't have to give us 500 bucks. Just dump out your boobs. Oh, but man. Dawson's Creek was chasing him down. Production for the film began June 5th, 2012. The film's art director, Steve Sacklin, searched a number of houses in Massachusetts as most of the film is set inside Wheeler's home. Yeah! Winchester, Massachusetts! We searched the entire state of Massachusetts for that house. Yes! Was this the scene? Yes! My location manager has never yeah. looked at many locations. For weeks, we would just drive down the street knocking on people's doors. Let's go! That is exactly what happened! Yes! Victory! But they didn't film inside your house, right? No, they no no no. <laughs> they didn't. Yeah, here's I, Connor's house right here. No, but that I, I <laughs> swear I have been in this house before. <laughs> every house in Massachusetts basically looks the same, and that Good is for you, man. Uh, that was that was That's cool. A big win. That was a big win. Big pull. Big Needed win. That. Man, what's next? I don't even know. If I we got to end on that. that. Oh, okay. In yeah. local local news, uh, Victorville trucker arrested in Indiana after traffic stop leads to seizure of 162 pounds of meth. Oh, wow. Holy shit. And Bill wants them to look for his fucking hit and run. Yeah, Bill, we got hundreds of pounds of meth coming oh, through the state. my Civic. Yeah, I have a fight, man. All right. Uh, he, uh, he's, yeah, not. he's gone. Oh. This is not as fun. No, he has his feet up right now. Just oh, okay. looking at me. So, he, yeah, he's sick of it. Is meth cool? I don't know. Breaking Bad made it really cool, I think. It did. But, like, what's it do to you? What do you feel do like? Do you think doing alcohol is cool? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Tony. <laughs> Actually, I, do. I, do. I, do. I do. I think meth just gives you some sort of uh, like indestructible. So, like super, the, so the thing is, is most people who are on like oxys or perks, mm-hmm. they turn to meth because it's way cheaper. Oh, yeah. Is that what that is? So there you go. It's like a cheap painkiller that That's you smoke. Sweet. You should try it. <laughs> 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 you should try it and tell us exactly how it uh, is. Cool. You can't die the first time you do it, can you? No. Okay. Cool. It's not like cocaine. Everything in moderation, you know? Yeah. Just a little, a little dabble, do you? Mm-hmm. Bro. Oh, yeah, you'll get high as hell. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know how that goes, Tony. Okay, I'll report back next episode. What's next? Uh, oh. 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 After 17 oh. years, <laughs> they called off their engagement. <laughs> J-Lo and Ben Affleck are back. Okay. I'm, still, I'm nice. still Jenny from the block. This is a big win for you guys up there, huh? Huge. This is awesome. You go back and watch that Jenny from the Block music video when he's kissing her cheeks. You knew she Booty was always going to be with Ben, dude. Or this face is cheeks. Awesome. Booty cheeks on the boat. Tony, maybe we get a second edition of one of your favorite films of all time. <gasps> oh, Jagili? <laughs> is Jagili coming back? <laughs> Sounds like it. Jagili, too. Jagili? Feels like it. 
Here's Massively. the thing. Here's Who's the, the thing. Other Jersey girl? I don't know if they're going to be together long enough. Hold on. Ben's going to be ripping darts and blowing them in her face, and she's not going to Yeah, lose I do wonder if J-Lo can withstand a card in a day. But, <laughs> do you uh, think they saw each other on the dating app? No, it's. I saw something that Ben's been reaching out since February. Yeah, he was, he uh, was a sick puppy. He's a dirt devil. He's fiending for it. <laughs> there you go. Hey, that's Ben. It's a damn shame, A Rod. You know, sorry, he damn doesn't play fair. You see, tells me A Rod's gonna be just fine. I don't know. I saw something that he's this also is shocked. A, this is a this classic. Is this is a classic Red Sox Yankees rivalry. <laughs> yeah, I think that's the only reason Alpha like did it. You know, <laughs> you know, fuck A Rod. I'm going after A Rod's girl. <laughs> <laughs> How do you for, like dumb apples? Good for Affleck, dude. How you like me? Yeah. Is J Lo <laughs> ever gonna take like a week though for herself? No. I don't know. I think JLo is just one of those girls, you know that. And JLo is uh, older. What than does that mean? <laughs> what the fuck? What are that, you that always, that that always needs, oh, that it spit it always out. needs, you know, a uh, right hand man. She's Jenny from Whoa. the block. Whoa. Yeah, Whoa. she was. That was before she was performing at Super Bowls. Okay, still she's doing Jenny that shit from now. the block, hey, dude. You know who was in the stands? Cheering Jenny from the block on when she was performing <laughs> at Super Bowl Fifty Two, A Rod. Okay, is he yeah, not she, Ben Affleck? I mean, this, she left him in the dust. Yeah, this is two the weeks thing. later. J- they're gonna get married. J Lo doesn't want some fucking stooge filming her performing, giggling like a schoolgirl. Well, I think A-Rod, she wants a man wants hacking a darts, I agree. crushing Duncan, Duncan Donut. I think it was also until rumor, she wakes up and rumored that A Rod was sleeping with that uh, chick from Beach House. Oh, I did oh, see that. Wow. Mm. I forget her name right now. But Summer Beach House? Yeah. Summer House? Summer House. Yeah. Summer High Tide. Morgan, maybe? Might have been the same girl that fucking said she was sleeping with Cutler, too, so she could be a liar. I thought that was the girl from a uh, different Bravo TV show. Uh, Winter House? No, it was Southern Charm. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're, yeah. Right. you're right. You're right. Oh, when I went on my vacation, I was uh, they were filming that there. Oh, what, did they use your driveway? No, they were, I was just eating a steak. It was in the restaurant. It was really weird. Hmm. Not okay. the driveway, though. <laughs> it was not the driveway. <laughs> What's next? Oh, shit. Oh, here we go. That's alien. Uh, beachgoers stumble upon a rarely seen deep creature known as the football fish. This thing looks absolutely putrid. It looks disgusting. I'm sure Mitt says that he could probably fucking go underwater and beat this thing's ass. Well, that's the thing oh, from Finding Nemo, yeah. right? Yeah, that's like yeah. the really scary thing from Finding Nemo. Yeah, that's it's that. like the scariest fish in the entire fucking world. You can always tell it's from the depths yeah. when it's got one of those dangly antennas on top. Yeah, it's like a, it they call it the molly oh fish. God. I've seen AVP, and this is this is A. Yeah. That's it does look like A. Imagine tripping on molly, and this fucking fish comes in front of you. You shouldn't be deep sea diving that far down. On your molly? On molly. No. Because you you're going to get the spins on the way back up. Why is your this thing washing broke. up? This is, fu- this is fucked up. Is that the whole fish, or is that no, just I think it's the just head? head, dude. Some, no, some, I think no, that's the full fish. That's no, why it's called the football fish, because it just looks yeah. like a football. Dude, it, if it, it's deep enough, it fucking lights up and shit. This yeah. is like a fish that's in the like, trench. What do you call that? Yeah. yeah. The, as he the just meat said, the trench. Yeah. As the Marianas. As he just said, the uh, lights on his head. Well, no, the body does, too. So once it catches the fish, the whole body lights up. The whole yeah. body does? Like, Turn up, we're eating. Yeah, it's fucking weird, dude. These fish are amazing. I've always wanted one. Can't. You could probably get one of those. You can't you put it in a pool. I'd like to pick this thing and put you my hand in it. Like a pool a pop- <laughs> <laughs> you can't oh, find, your day find a pool that simulates. Find a pool that simulates. Let me light your day up. <laughs> <laughs> That's my friend. That's him. <laughs> That's my guy. <laughs> Give me your last money. <laughs> uh. No, but yeah, these fish are amazing, though. I, it's very weird. It's like, once it dies, it just fucking floats up, you think? Uh, I don't know. And then just washes ashore. Maybe uh, one Shut of the up. other, maybe a dolphin punted it to the ocean. No! <laughs> Got him. Uh, Football fish, yeah, bitch. Uh, kill me. What's what's next? Oh, shit. Oh, here we go. Titan. For the con- sixth consecutive year, Chicago has been named the rattiest city in America, according to Orkin. <laughs> Ew. Orkin is the uh, company who uh, gets rid of... Uh, Correct. Yes. Yeah. Just make sure. Bugs. <laughs> to combat the issue, the Treehouse Humane Society has placed <laughs> over 1,000 feral cats onto the Chicago streets <laughs> since 2012. So they're Egyptian? What? Egyptian cats? No, not feral. So you think feral means Egyptian? While or Egyptians pharaoh, did yeah. worship cats and did think they were, were they divine pharaohs? creatures, that word feral is not pharaoh. Oh, I just saw the word. Never mind. There's not. Yeah. It's PH. Yeah. Feral just means wild. Dude. So, yeah, this is a good move. Huh? It's like uh, Pubcat. No, no, no. Pubcat was 
was not Egyptian. Pubcat was True. not domestic. Was you don't know, Mitch. You don't know. You never met Pubcat, Mitch. Don't Pubcat was on a that. movie, dude. Does he think he knows what? Pubcat? Yeah, that's what yeah, it sounds like. Pubcat, dude. You don't. I've this is good though. Of that thing and that thing was not a domestic. Cat. Shut your mouth, dude. Well, Pubcat is a fat stooge. Whoa! Yeah, I said it. Uh, oh my God. What's Z? Yeah, uh, what's going on in Chicago, dude? What dude. the hell was that about? Yeah, that was fucked up, dude. Uh, I'll answer after an apology. Yeah. You guys don't care about Pubcat. When's the last time you've seen and talked about? Yeah, home two days ago. Yeah, yeah, dude, home I, now, I send dude. him fucking treats all the time. Yep, two days no, ago. No, no, no. Yeah. You just got a new dog from the Satanist. You're, yeah. you're past. You're done with nah, Pubcat. No, dude. I send cat treats. We should definitely Pubcat. keep an eye on Zeke and make sure he doesn't get any santa- Satanic <laughs> <laughs> blood <laughs> going through his yeah, yeah, yeah. If your dog scratches you, you let us know. eyeliner. Yeah. <laughs> Black nail polish. Um, They do this for snakes, right? They just released snakes. They did it with... Uh, Release the snakes. They did it in Yellowstone with wolves to kill something wolves. like that. Uh, the uh, You know what I'm talking about. The grub. They released a bunch of wolves. We the did talk about that before. I can't remember. So where do they yeah. get these cats? The grub population. Uh, from they the just, Humane Society, dude. They're shelter cats. Oh, so that's what they do. They, they capture all these cats and they go, let's get these rats out. Yeah, yeah. Like, hey, go to work. Now we got cats everywhere. So what, what's the next step to get rid of all the cats? Well, then you they don't, just, want, you don't like want to know. They released that guy in Houston who was pointing his gun at the tiger, and they, they released him Gumpy's kill buddy from making a murder. And he, <laughs> 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 oh, there's another up. one. Maybe it's messed leave up. Leave Stephen Avery out of this. How long do you think it's gonna take to uh, take care of this this uh, mass problem? Well, it's been nine years. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see how good these cats are. Yeah, it does look <laughs> like that was. In so was it like a town meeting, and they're like. They're all like trying to like, what should we do to get rid of these rats? And one guy in the bag was like, let's release the cats. Yeah, and they're like, holy shit, that guy's a genius. <laughs> Pay that man a million dollars right now. So the cats are clearly not helping because for the sixth consecutive year, Chicago. No, this is the first time. This is the first time they're trying it. No, no it since, 2012. since 2012. Since 2012. They've 12, placed 1,000. They've placed over 1,000 since 2012. So they've basically released like 200 cats a year, and it hasn't done a goddamn thing. Are the rats just mutilating the cats? Are the cats <laughs> losing this war? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. It feels like, or the cats just have an agreement with the rats, and it's like, hey, look. <laughs> We're going to get our boys out of the Humane You're Society. Saying. We're going to act like we're killing you. You know, there'll be a couple casualties no, here. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds like the Jets and the Sharks. Yeah, basically like the movie Cats. Release the buttholes. Release the buttholes. <laughs> Release all, the buttholes. They, they all meet up in the basement of the Willis Tower. <laughs> yes. No, exactly. no, no. Hey, Willis Tower is our stomping ground. Maybe that's, that's a different tower, but they, they won't go to fucking uh, Sears Tower. <laughs> well, I wouldn't either. It's filled with rats. It's also um, non-existent rats anymore. Rats can't oh. fucking climb. Can't go somewhere it doesn't exist. Um, What's next? Seems like we hit the uh, last one. Uh, we have reached the depths. We have reached the Marianas Trench of the folder. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, everybody. Thank Listeners you. and watchers, if you are listening to the podcast and you enjoy it, you should also check it out, out on YouTube and Ooh. try watching it and enjoying it. I see a lot of people tweeting at us that they're, you know, they put it on the back porch when it's nice out. It's on the back porch. And it's watch a good it. idea. Oh, That's put a good your idea. Feet up, huh? Put, put your feet, feet up, up a little bit. Just hang out. Take a break from Take CSI Miami. Off. Watch the pod. No, we appreciate everyone listening and watching. Uh, be a friend, tell a friend, as Pat always likes to say. Go check us out on youtube.com slash the pod PMI. Yeah. Finally get the URL working. Sweet. Hell yeah. Shout out. Woo. <laughs> <laughs>